Virginia Cavaliers number one team in the country take on the Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets for his last six years has won 11 at least 11 league games in the ACC that's a three for Kyle Guy he really struggled from the field and from the three-point line he's got to stop kicking his legs out when he shoots it. another nice ball screen offense there by Georgia Tech saw the double team coming finds a Kogi and turns it into three to tie the game and it doesn't all the scoring has taken a dip for a Kogi the seven for 27 the last two games and had not made a three but now back and forth they go from deep as guy answers a Kogi he winced as he picked it up but he looks all right now nice pass Lammers down the lane contacted in the air by Hunter Jackson into a three, and he gets it to swirl home. There's Lammers. He spins on Salt and goes on glass for two. Ten seconds for the Wahoos. All for three. Got it. Forty-six percent from beyond the arc. He's a threat wherever he goes. Right goes baseline and scores through contact to quiet the crowd that was surging with the Cavs on defense. Guarded by Hall. He trucks like a running back down the lane. He's got the last five for Georgia Tech. Hi, Jerome. Baseline, corner to corner. Hunter three some space. And sends it underneath a slam from Diakite. Jerome wide open. Gets that one every time. They've had Ty Jerome in his face. He's just not been able to get any wiggle room on the offensive end. He's legal for three. Jerome does it again. And it's 63-51. So it's at least a share of the ACC regular season title with a three-game lead over Duke. Well, it's all but a sure thing at this point.